everybody, it's Katrina. Welcome to the Crafty Corner. I am just going through some inventory here to roll some things over from Valentine's Day um, to Mother's Day because uh, I don't think I'll be using any of these for Easter. Um, so while I'm doing that, I did have a tip and a wonder, things that I wanted to talk about and ask you about. So, um, did, did anybody have a mishap during your street sales, um, that you could share a tip with and, um, maybe we'll learn something from it. I'll go first. All right, so one of the baskets that I sold was a beautiful basket. And um, uh, the man was so excited about the basket. Usually I take my little price tag off of it because it's just a tied-on wood tag. And I take them off so that I can repurpose them for other baskets. He wanted to keep that. He wanted her to see how much he paid for this basket and everything. So I left the tag on there and all of that. And he leaves excited and everything. Well, then he comes back a little while later, and I thought, uh-oh, maybe he wants another basket. Well, he comes back, and he brought me the um, body wash bag. Um, and the reason being was that when he opened the cap, he said the seal was broke on the actual body wash. So I looked at it. Now, I don't know if they broke the seal or not. Um, because I did my due diligence in checking all of them, and I had one, um, and I didn't check them until I got home. I should have checked them in the store, but luckily enough, I only had one that had the seal broke, so I was going to keep that one for me, and the only thing that I could think of that happened was when my daughter was helping me make baskets, that one somehow or another got in the basket. I'm not real sure how that happened. Um, or if if that was one that was not broke, I haven't been through all of them again yet to the ones that didn't sell to see. Um, so I don't know if they broke that seal at home. Um, and strangely enough, I replaced his bottle for him right there on the spot, no problem. It wasn't a big issue, um, but I replaced it and gave them one that ne didn't come with the seal. So, I couldn't really figure out what his issue was, that the seal was broke on it, or they wanted a seal on it, because the one I gave him didn't have a seal. And I told him that, I said, now this one here do doesn't come with a seal. It's already unsealed when you, when you purchase it. So, I said, and it's the only one I have. So, I gave him that one. And he gave me back the other one. You know, now, not knowing if they broke the seal and maybe they did something to it, I don't know. I really don't know because I did check the seal on all of them. And like I said, I only had one and it was that, that same kind um, that uh, the seal was broke on. And I mean, literally, I checked them when I got home. So anyway, that was my mishap. I was able to just replace that bottle. I actually replaced it with something that's a little bit cheaper that didn't have a seal on it at all. Um, so I didn't lose any money in this. Um, and I'm just wondering if any of you had any kind of mishap or a story you'd like to share. You know, so we learn and do better the next time. Um, I'm going to make sure that any inventory I have that's defective is removed from the shed itself so that it's not even in here with inventory that I do use. But anyway, as I sort through all of my stuff, <laughs> I wanted to share that with you and um, encourage you to share yours because we learn and grow from these stories. Um, and I, I was doing my due diligence and checking those because I learned it from someone's story. All right, so make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for tuning in. And remember, be blessed, but most importantly, be a blessing. Bye-bye.